Hello everybody, this is Mina and Nina, and look at Sands of the Pirates! <coughs> anyway, I'm back playing Undertale. Just give me a sec, hold on, it's F, yeah, it's F4. Forgot you don't move with WASD mouse. Get out of there. Onwards I go. This is a box. Oh. I would do though. You can't use items when they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. <laughs> Use the box. Sure. Okay. I think I think I got everything I need. All right. Whoa. Nice. Let's see what happens. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, I just wanted to see what was down here. Echo flower. I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Huh. Go up here. Aha! There's a tutu lying on the ground here. Will you take it? Take it. You got the old tutu. I like the little squeaky sound they make. <laughs> That's cute. Alright, item. Info. Armor of. Ooh. Finally, a protective piece of armor. <laughs> Item. Yes! You equipped the old tutu. Yay, more defense! Oh. Well, this isn't ominous at all. Huh? Hi, Anayan! I'm here with my daily report! Uh, regarding that demon I called you about earlier? Huh? Did I fight them? Y yes of course I did! I fought them va valiantly! What? Did I capture them? Oh well... No. I tried very hard on dying, but in the end... I failed. What? Y you're going to take the human soul yourself? But I'm dying! You don't have to destroy them! You see? You see? I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. <gasps> uh oh. Ah. Okay. I'm glad I couldn't move there or else I would have died because I just tried to move. <laughs> well, that was kind of scary and worrying. Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome! I'm so jealous. What'd you do to get her attention? <laughs> Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's nice music. A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. When four bridge seeds line in the water, they will sprout. Wearing them on my head. <laughs> oh, look at a lo I love that lo cute little squeaky sound they make.
Uh oh. Rang me Aaron? 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 Aaron. Flex is in. Flex. You flex. Aaron flexes twice as hard. And tech. Attack increases for you too. Flexing contest? Okay, flex more. Okay, that was okay, that was okay. Flex, you flex harder. Aaron flexes thrice as hard. Nice, I won't lose though. Ah. Uh. Reflex. Um, this is very hard. Reflex himself out of the room. You won. <laughs> how how do I? Oh, I can. I want to read that sign. Oh, this music. I don't like the feeling this music gives me. I feel intimidated. Congratulations! You failed the puzzle! <laughs> Get on that stupid bridge. Uh, sometimes it's very precise with how you have to get on things. Hey, hold on. What's this? Oh, Ferris made the bell blossom continue. Call the bridge seeds back to where they started. Okay, so... Okay. I think... I need to go... A dusty tutu. Is that true? Are you wearing a dusty tutu? I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I'm wearing a dusty tutu. So you are wearing a dusty tutu. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. Click. Oh yeah, I forgot to call him when I got his number. I'm gonna try to call Toriel. Aww. Ring, ring. Mm -hmm. This puzzle. I've got it! Try to build a bridge with the bridge seeds! Oh. Okay, I didn't have any options there. Woo! What's that? Wishing room. A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you ho hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now, all we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. 
Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Whooshua shuffles up. Um. Clean? Ask Wusha to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Green means clean. Addy. He's rinsing off a pizza. Yay! Oh gosh, I need to eat something. You eat one half of the bicycle. Okay. Come on, sis, make a wish! I wish my sister and I will see the real star someday. Look through the telescope? Check wall. Check what wall? Which wall? Where wall? Who wall? Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. I don't... Which wall? Oh, this wall. Okay. <laughs> Ancient writing covers the walls. You can just make out the words. The war of human and monsters. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist even outside the human body, even after death. If a monster defeats a human, it can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable power. Unfathomable. Unfathomable. It is an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. I wish I could see it. I want to be unsettled. Guess we're going here. I'm gonna try calling Papyrus again. Ring, ring. There's no response. Mm. <gasps> uh oh. Okay, all fully healed. Gotta figure out how to avoid do dodge those attacks better.
don't bump into me. Please don't see me. Please don't bump into me. Yo, did you see that? A nun just touched me! I'm never washing my face ever again! Man, are you unlucky! If you are standing just a little bit to the left, yo, don't worry, I'm sure we'll see her again. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna hold off in case there's a safe point in the next room. Okay, there is. Phew! Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical crystal, it fills me with determination. Ha ha ha! Squeak! <laughs> this cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Yo, dude, I'm dying. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 50,000 gold to use this premium telescope, but since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Use the telescope? Yes. All I see is red. Well, it's a little different color at the bottom. Like, it gets darker red up there. What is, what is even is this? Huh? You weren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. <laughs> what? Oh. What? Okay, there's something on my eye now. What? It's an odd looking telescope. Use the box. I'll store my manly banana. What's well, a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? Possibly. I have a blotch on my eye now. <laughs> You're here, a passing a conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? Hmm, just one, but it's kind of stupid. Ring. Uh oh, this is Papyrus. Remember what I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know her opinion of you is very murdery. But I met you. you already knew that, and because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing. A dusty tutu, because I knew, of course, after such a suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes. You're such a smart cookie. This is why you're safe and I didn't lie. No betrayal anywhere. Being friends with everyone is easy. <sighs> oh, yeah. Uh. Maybe that's a good idea. <laughs> Alright. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna go back to the box. <gasps> what was that? Did I just see Flowey? I don't know, man. I don't know. Alright, so take out the manly bandana. And equip it instead of the tutu. Even though I'll have less defense. <laughs> oh, hey! I relocated my store, but there are still no customers. Fortunately, I thought of a solution! Punch cards! Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. 
If you have three cards, you can trade them for free ice cream. They're sure to get customers to come back. Ice cream. Yeah, I want to buy some. Super, here you go. Your card's in the box. I'm going to buy one more because I'm going to need... space. Well then, tell your friends, there's ice cream hidden in the depths of a watery cavern. <laughs> box restoring punch cards. It's empty right now. Ah, dang it. Please, please come back. Okay, um, I'll have to store my punch cards in the other box, apparently. I'll come back later. Let's see, what's this way? A ducky? Why, hello ducky. Man, this cave is pretty. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? You got the ballet shoes. I am. Info. Oven at seven. <laughs> these shoes. These shoes make you feel incredibly dangerous. <laughs> okay, I'll equip them. Yes. You equip the ballet shoes. wonders if its tears are sanitary. <laughs> Here. 
I'm Onion Sen. Onion Sen, you hear? <laughs> You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Even though the water is getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time, but... Hey, that's okay. It means moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. Aww. And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though. You hear? I'm not gonna fix everything. You hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean. You hear? <sighs> hey, there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. And waterfall. Aw, oh, he made me feel sad. I'm gonna turn around and visit him. <gasps> Yay, hello! Hi! <laughs> so cute. I want to take him with me. Just look at him! He's so cute and lonely, I wanna take him with me. Just stuff him in a bottle and take him with me wherever I go. <laughs> Did you hear? You're back! I'll tell you a big secret. I'm starting a band, you hear? It's called the Red Hot Chi Bee Peppers. <laughs> All I thought of was the name. And I don't play instruments or sing. Whoa! Do you think we'll be popular? Yeah, me too. Oh, you're so cute. Well, I want to be friends with you. I'm gonna do this over and over again. Hi. Hi. <laughs> oh, did you hear? I got nothing else to talk about. Oh. Well, bye. I guess. I'll go see if there's room in the aquarium for you. Maybe. I don't know. Don't know what to do there. <laughs> 
This power has no counter, and GD Human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And, in, and an incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death. If only for a few moments. A human could absorb its soul, but this is set it has never happened, and now it never will. It's a statue. The structures at its feet seem dry. Please take one. Take an umbrella? He took an umbrella. Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome! Let's go! Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night. Knowing she was going to beat me up. Ha <laughs> ha. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king... He had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. <laughs> um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Well, this is nice. I sense a little spike in the <laughs> Hello, kid. Yo, this lift is way too steep. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. Oh. Okay. Return the umbrella? Put back. You return the umbrella. Thanks. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. <laughs> The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. Save. Uh, in the end, it could hardly be called a war. Un United, the humans were too powerful and us monsters were too weak. Not a single soul was taken, and countless monsters returned to dust. You did set my time off the, for 30 minutes, right? <sighs> what did you set it to? What? I did! Well, I'm going to assume it's been 30 minutes, since I thought I'd asked my little brother to set the timer for 30 minutes, but apparently he didn't. So, it may be 30 minutes longer, or may not. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> but, um, I'm just gonna stop it here. Good luck and happy gaming.